So in this question, we read, um, Alicia uses the quadratic formula to determine the roots of the equation 0 equals 4x squared plus 13x plus 10. In the course of her work, she determines that the zeros can be written in the form negative 13 plus or minus p over 8. What's p? Okay, so we just got to dive in and start solving this. So we are using the quadratic formula. So it will be the negative of the b value, and that's good because I can see that already in her answer, plus or minus the square root of 13 squared minus 4 times 4 times 10 all over 2 times 4. And there's there's the 8 in the denominator there. So really what I have happening here is I just need to see what happens to that to that radical there. So those, I know this is going to be negative 13 plus or minus something um, all over 8 here. So I just got to figure out what's going on here. Well, 13 squared is going to be 169. Okay. And then negative 4 times 4 is going to be negative 16 times 10 is, is 160. And so take a quick look at that, and I'm going to get negative 13 plus or minus. If I simplify that, that the difference there is 9 over 8. So now the question is, what is the p value? Now you've you got to be careful when you, when you do this. You've got to look at the question the way it's worded. There's no radical over the p. So p is the square root of 9, and that is 3. And so the answer here is A.